and welcome to Sam Tech Pro. Today I am showing this drill, uh, which is total cordless drill made by Total. Works in a both direction. As you can see, this is the most smooth drill I have ever seen, in only seventy-five dollars. Uh, the chuck can support about ten millimeter of bit. They also give free bit for the screws, the star and the flat screwdriver. This is really powerful and there are about 15, uh, 16 torque settings. However, it does not contain hammering, but it does have the drill mode. And there is a variable speed with the trigger. Also, when you release the trigger, there is an electrical brake, which stops the drill instantly. Alright, let's test it on my power supply. This is my power supply. I built this. I'm gonna connect it with this drill, and then gonna test it. Now, currently, voltage are 12 volt because the battery provided with this drill is 12 volt. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna just connect it to my power supply, and then turn it on and see how much current it is taking. You can also have a tutorial on the power supply that I built uh, at my channel. There it goes. On the start, there were about 3 amps. I'm limiting the current. On limiting the current, the voltage has been dropped a lot. so. I opened full amperes and it is only taking 1.7. However, my supply can deliver about 5 amps. Checking the amperage on the different torque setting and different speed, as you can see. I think it is enough energy efficient. This is a place where they provided the bit and there are the torque settings. Very easy to use. And right now I have opened the battery case because I want to know that why the battery was getting heat up. This is the drill mode. On the torque setting 1, I just monitored the less use of the current. So right now, we're gonna talking about the battery. They provided this adapter, which is 18 volt, while the batteries are 12 volt, because there are 10 cells of 1.2 volt in the battery case. These batteries are NIMH, and this is the adapter, or whatever you can say. This is just used for the cutoff function 